Hello there, kids. It is I, Stray Cat, the one and only, coming with another episode of Skyrim Special Edition Survival. Alrighty, when we left off, we had, well, <laughs> we had been uh, dealing with bandits a little bit, but for right now, uh, we're going to see if we can deal with giants over here. Oh no, I'm drained. Wahoo, that's going to be an immediate problem. Uh, I also did some fishing a little bit. Didn't really get a lot of salmon, but I did get some river beddies and other uh, alchemical ingredients. So, you know, it wasn't a complete waste of time. But uh, after Valheim Towers, I figured, screw it, why not? See how the giant's camp will be. Oh, there's two of them. Oh, that might be a problem for little old me in leather armor. <laughs> ah, never mind. I'll uh, just mark it off on the map. Just so I know it's here. Golden Rock. I think that's what the name was. I don't quite remember. <laughs> I'm going to check real quick. It was Goldoon. Goldoon Rock. Uh, I'm trying to see if there's a treasure chest that maybe I can sneak to. Maybe. No, I'm not seeing it. I'm going to have to take this on when I'm a lot higher level. If there's two giants here. Especially because that giant looks like it's a little higher ranking than the other one. But I will take the flowers. And now run away. Take those flowers too. Okay, well, that is that. That's not gonna happen. <laughs> not at all, actually. So I guess um inventory wise, I am a little overburdened. I guess I should just go back to White Run and try to offload some of it. Uh before I head back this way <laughs> and go to Kravunger Cave to finish that thing for uh, Bikai. That's something I will have to do. So, might as well do it. But first, I need to make sure I have enough uh, inventory space to do it with. And I guess I could just technically follow the river. This is also technically what I did to when it came to fishing. But uh, I could follow the river to get back to Whiterun. And eventually I will fall, because <laughs> this, yeah, this whole method I was taking was not a good, uh, not a good trek direction to go in. And there's also a uh, <laughs> couple mud crabs I killed, and it looks like there might be another one. And there's also some, uh, oops, again. there's also some slaughter fish, that's the saber cat that's right over there killed i'm going to try not to uh get the saber cat's attention because don't necessarily want to fight them oh great hi there wolf Bastard. go away from me there we go let's take that and you can go on your merry fucking way away from me I shouldn't be swearing this early in the episode, but screw it. <laughs> oh! I guess the wolf killed an elk for me. That was nice of them. Hey! Tundra Homestead. The whole bunch of... farming stuff. I guess I hadn't bought a house yet, have I? Because I would have bought this. <laughs> so, clearly, I haven't gotten a house yet. So I don't have any farming thing going on. So that was good for me. That I was uh, holding on to some ingredients. Because otherwise I wouldn't have been able to get some of them back. The what? Oh, well, hello. Didn't think you were here. What am I doing? I'm going to sprint after it, damn it. 
Okay. Eventually I'll catch it. Eventually I will catch it. And it'll be like this. Aha! There we go. <laughs> Just flump. Alright. There we go. Was that a bit messed up? Eh, maybe a little. Maybe a little bit. Now, I remember there being a shiny cow nearby. What the what? Why are there wolves over here? Just not being dealt with. Like at all. You're welcome, by the way. It's the wolf sitting here. Like, guards not dealing with it or nothing. Oh, there's a shiny cow. There's the shiny cow. Hello, shiny cow. Hello. Okay. <laughs> I don't know why I was bothering to look at the shiny cow. Just a shiny cow. Ooh, I'll take this. Thank you. I'll take that as well. It's also useful. Just not as useful as the butterfly wings. Because butterfly wings are health. Tundra cotton is resistance. It's resistance to all magic, sure. But it's still a lesser overall. What in the shit? Why is there just a giant... He what are these guards doing? They're just letting giants roam the countryside. <laughs> Just like no whatsoever. Oh, this is gonna be bad. Wait. Wait, what? The giant's just standing there doing nothing. What? Let him pass? What? Then watch him get mad at me. No. No way. <laughs> what? Just a chill giant dude. Hell yeah, man. He's just scratching his back with his lap. <laughs> hey, dude, what's up? Hey. What's up, man? <laughs> hey, you're all right, man. You're all right. You can, you can stay there. That's okay. That's cool. You're cool. <laughs> oh, that's amazing. Oh, that's amazing. Oh, that's great. <laughs> it's friggin' great. All right. Okay. Anyway, I shouldn't be, like, I guess I can, because it's an abandoned house anyway, but still. I shouldn't be, like, sitting here just taking stuff. Should I? I mean... <laughs> I mean, they're there. Oops. I overburdened myself. Oh, boy. Well... Do I have a strength potion? No, I don't. Alright. Well. <laughs> that's unfortunate. <laughs> that is unfortunate what I did to myself. Uh, let's try to make it to the smelter. I could deal with some of the weight I'm carrying. There we go. Alright. Flawless Emerald. Oh my gosh. Oh goodness. Iron Mace. Iron Ore, but I'm holding on to that. Uh, Elven Shield. Yes. Um, oh my. I have so many things made of steel. Goodness me. Okay. Uh, I'm not getting rid of those. Getting rid of this and this and that, though, for sure. But, uh. Wait, God, let's 
Hey, oops, now I was holding on to those. The helmets... Mm, yeah, I guess... The normal helmets I'll get rid of. Yeah, that ain't too bad. That ain't too bad. Alright. How's that with my weight? Yes, I'm much better now. I'm now at 627. Nice. Alright, well in that case, I shall head back to White Run. To do the thing. Involving selling things. And or buying a house. Might have the money for it when I'm all done. Key phrase might. Key phrase might. Well, hello. Uh, who are you? Vilkus? Yes, you're Vilkus. Hello. Hello, Vilkus. Come to me with questions. Well? I know our history almost I mean, as well as Vignar by now. Except I can remember it. Well then, what does it mean to be a companion? There's been a group called the Companions for over 4,000 years. Oh, now I'm hungry. It's been many different things in that time. I bet. A conquering army, ruthless mercenaries, mm. a band of drunken louts, and the esteemed company you see before you. Okay. But there's always been a kind of honor to it. Mm. We don't deal in politics or underhanded sneaking. I see. We try to uphold the legacy of Ysgramor, to bear his good name such that it never be forgotten, and always be spoken with reverence. Hmm. Fair enough. Well, I'm also looking for work. We've received a desperate missive. Oh, yeah? A citizen of White Run has been kidnapped. Oh, no. The companions have been asked for assistance, and we shall answer, particularly when the pay is as good as this. Really? Get moving. I shudder to think what might happen if you're too late. Understandable. Rescue mission. Alfhild Battleborn from Broken Fang Cave. Oh, boy. Broken Fang Cave is... Where? Oh, that's a ways. Oh, my. Okay, well. That is a thing we shall have to deal with. Shiny cow. Cow. God, I'm becoming my mother. <laughs> okay. Anytime she sees a cow on the road, she has to go cow. Even if she's driving the damn car, <laughs> she has to go cow. Look at the cow. Kind of her shtick. Anyway, off of that subject, <laughs> we should probably try and help uh, that battleborn. I don't know all of them, but I think that's one of the daughters, I think. So we'll have to get there quick, for sure. Broken Fang Cave, though. I don't remember what's there. Well, either way. Either way, it shall be a difficult battle, probably. Huh. You know what? Give me a second. I need to check if my computer's having a rough time of it. Maybe something running in the background. Ah, it looks like it's running something. Oh. It was having a rough time of it, but it wasn't uh, anything's fault. It was uh, Office running amok. Okay. So I was noticing some uh, skipped frames on the encoding, so I wanted to make sure it wasn't something that I was doing. It wasn't. It was Office uh, updating its settings. Ah, Microsoft Office. Thing I rarely use, but has so much stuff devoted to it. The only reason I have office is because of word anyway. 
Okay, so, selling things to Belathor. That should get most of my inventory cleared out. Hello. Everything's for sale, my friend. Everything. Yep. If I had a sister, I'd sell her in a second. Yep, you keep saying that. Some may call this junk. Me, I call them treasures. Well, let's see those treasures of yours. Huh? All right, selling some of my stuff I don't need. I don't know why I had that. Don't know why I have those. This... Mm, yeah, this, this is some sort of money. That's, that's some money. Those are some monies right there. Should I get rid of that? I don't think I should. I might be able to use that. Maybe. Not sure how, but I'll find a way. I'll hold on to that. We'll get rid of that. We'll get rid of this, primarily because it doesn't have any armor on it, and I can make something just as good later on. So, all of that. Um, eh. Sell those, I guess. Sell these for sure, because I don't need any of those. Ooh, another level up. Love it. Um, resist poison, resist fire, or resist magics, which I can make better potions at this point, so I'll get rid of that. Get rid of those. Well, these aren't too bad. They're not great, but they're not too bad. Um, wait a minute, those were the potions I can make. <laughs> I just realized now. Uh, my drain status makes the amount of points it restores less. I forgot about that. Until just after I sold it. So, screw me. Ooh, Emetrine. Yeah, that's pretty. Alright. Orange. Okay. Cuprite. Uh, Euclas. Euclas? I don't know how to pronounce it. I will keep this forever. I don't even care. I don't even care. I don't even care. I don't even care. I don't know. That was a reference to a bit. Oh, no. Didn't mean to sell that. Oops. Oh, well. Too late now. Rose Quartz. Rose Quartz. Uh, we are the crystal gems. <laughs> okay. Yes. And let's sell this too. And those. And that. And that. That is pretty, but I'm going to have to sell that. Why am I holding on to a tankard? Oh, that must have been that one item a few episodes <laughs> back that I accidentally picked up. Or was it? last episode i forget it was recently i remember that but oh cyberite that is pretty that is very pretty kind of want to hold on to that all right cool all right that brings my gold up to nine thousand ninety five hundred holy crap that's actually pretty good Actually, pretty, 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 pretty good. Okay. Let's move on. Come back. Beautiful. Then we can buy that house and I can offload the junk that I shouldn't be carrying on me. Oops, I didn't mean to do that. I keep meaning to sprint, and I hit the wrong button to sprint, because my fingers are used to other controls. Oopsie doopsie. 
Alright. Uh, I guess Avanichi's up there. That's good. Uh, did I disenchant that one axe already? Uh, I don't think I did, but it's fine. No way, I did. I did. I did. Okay. It would have been up in the weapons otherwise. That's fair. Um, Iron Hand Gauntlets... While I won't give them away, the enchantment is nice, so I'll just take the enchantment off of it. Um, archery. I want to double check something real quick. Just real quick. Can I wear the circlet with hood? No, I cannot. Balls. Not with this hood, anyway. The hood of the armor set I'm going to be making will allow me to do that. But, uh, not quite there yet. I don't think. Maybe I am. Maybe I can do that. I won't apologize for talking to my people. It does protect me every moment of the day. That might be so, but it will never stop me from trying. Well, I mean... Well, Avanichi, hello. I serve Jarl Balgrub as steward. I do appreciate your service. I also am here for the bounty at the Valtheim Towers bandits that I annihilated. Excellent. You've done us a great service. Here is your reward. Thank you. Ooh, 210 gold. Thank you. I appreciate it. I would like to purchase a homestead outside of the city. I know you have one out there. I kind of would like it. Wonderful. Here's the key to your new home. Thank you. All right. Enjoy your visit to Dragon's Reach. I'm going to Thank tell you. Father you said that. He'll tan your hide for sure. Ooh. Sibling fighting. Oh boy, don't I know how that goes. Thank. What hey, Lydia. Mean, my thing? Uh, I need you to follow me. So you Either have way. some of my stuff. So I need you to follow me to my house. The, oh. Oh, Amarin! There you are, buddy. Mercenary work? It might suit you. You'd be surprised how well it suits me. I have your sword. You found it. I've yeah. been looking for that blade for months. Yeah. You took on all those bandits yourself? Yeah. Thank you. Here, my father had a favorite sword and shield technique. Ooh. Let me teach it to you in honor of his memory. Thank you. I appreciate it. Thank you very right, much. Then. Thank you very much. Nice. Hell yeah. All right, now let's get out of here and go to our new home where I can then proceed to drop off my shit <laughs> that I've been holding on to this entire time. You there. Uh -huh. The Dawn Guard is looking for anyone willing to fight against the growing vampire menace. What do you say? Oh, yeah? I uh, haven't noticed any vampire menace yet. You're not paying attention, then, like almost everyone else around here. Okay. Haven't you heard that the Hall of the Vigilance was destroyed by vampires? Whoa, what? They never took the threat seriously, and now they paid the price. Oh, jeez. Vigilance? Dawn Guard? What are you talking about? The Vigilants mostly hunt down Daedra worshippers, which is why they got torn to pieces when they went up against vampires. That's why our leader, Isran, is re-establishing the Dawn Guard. Real, serious vampire hunters. Hmm. Where do I sign up? Ha! Huh. Isran's going to like you. Go talk to him at Fort Dawn Guard, southeast of Riften. He'll decide if you're Dawn Guard material. Ooh, excuse me. A little burpy there. But alrighty! Sounds good to me. How about you, Lydia? That sound good? Sound like an outfit you want to get into? Hmm. Oh, wait, that's right. You serve me. That's right. So anything I do, you have to do. <laughs> Alright. Anyway. Anywho. Let's get out of here. And go to our home. Each hold attracts its crime separately. Nice. I do appreciate that fact. 
and I'm very much going to appreciate it later. <laughs> I'm probably, probably very much going to appreciate it later. All right. Well. Take that. All right. Go to the house. How's my inventory? Yeah, I'm probably still going to want to get rid of some stuff before I get all the way over to Broken Fang uh, Cave there. I'm going to have to sprint like crazy. Whoop. Take that. It's mine now. I'm going to take this. It's mine now. Now, nah, leave that for later when I pick it up. <laughs> uh, everything is mine. All mine. Oh, hey. You're near the meadery. Who would have expected? Get drunk. Alright. Oh, I'll take those. And I'll take that. And I'll take these. And I'll take these. And these and these. Alright. Heading to the home. This is going to take a while. <laughs> Even if I'm sprinting like crazy, this will take a while. So I'm just picking flowers on the way. Why not? Why wouldn't I? Wonder if that uh, giant is still sitting over there. Nah? Aw. Aw, man. You're pretty cool, though, man. I let him chill. I don't just let him chill. Yes, I catch this. And I catch this. And I take that. Alright. Cool, 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 cool. And now all of this is mine. All of it. Means also, Lydia. I, back. I need you to give me back my things. At your command. I do appreciate that, uh, but I need all of my things back. Everything I have offloaded onto you, I need back. Thank you. You can keep the sword. The sword is yours. The sword is your thing. But uh, it's time for us I'll to head go. back home if you need me. Yes. I do appreciate it. Thank you. I will be overburdened and be going over here. Um, you're supposed to be going home. You know that, right? I, I don't think she cares. Okay, um, drop off all of that, all of these. I haven't been doing anything with my leather, huh? Yeah, that's, that's a problem. <laughs> that's a problem. I should be doing something with it. Um, the crundum ingots as well. I kind of need those. Now I think about it. But everything else? Steel? Not so much. Okay. Um, making... Okay. Well, there she goes. Making the armor I was talking about. Um, misc. Um, oh. That's right. I could do that. But that'll be after. Um, this will, this is an option, but it's not what I'm going to do. Uh, I'm going to go under leather and do, oh, I need steel for all of it. Well, I guess I'm going to be pulling some of those out <laughs> again. Uh, let's pull out, eh, 10 ought to do it. And I probably need some of these too. A little bit. Just a little bit. Okay. Um, leather. There we go. I was incorrect in needing iron. But I will need a lot of leather, which I have a lot of on my person. So let's just go through all of this. Jesus. There we go. Alright. 
ain't too bad. I'll wait until after I'm done making the armor before I start breaking down any extras. Okay, so. Good. Good. And then. I feel like, uh. Yeah, mantled robes with mantled hood looks good. Feels good. And then we put on this armor, which is, by the way, 41 on the leather armor itself and the robes is 52. So it is stronger than our current leather by a lot. Yep. There we go. Beautiful. Just what I wanted. Oh, it's also counting the leather bracers. That's weird. Huh. Weird. Interesting. Very interesting. Um, it's also counting the warmth from it as well, I'm assuming. Uh, but I get the look of the gloves. Alright, there we are. This is the armor we will be running for foreseeable future. I'm also hungry. <laughs> okay. Uh, before I go off on that little adventure to, uh, save the Battleborn child, I'm assuming. One of the children. I shouldn't say children. I think they're full grown. I think they're full grown ladies. Most of the uh, battleborns running about. Well, ladies and that one son. I'm not entirely sure how the whole family structure works, but um, either way. Drinking out of my can. Uh, Either way, I will need to save them. So I might as well get ready for that. Alright. There's that. And getting ready for that will mean making sure I get all of my stuff offloaded that I don't need. Um, might as well hold on to that. Because I will need to upgrade this armor. Which... Huh interesting interesting all right um can upgrade all of that but i thought i was higher up in smithing than i apparently am huh yeah i thought i was higher up hmm unfortunate but that is neither here nor there. I now have the home, which I shall now interpret with. And. Haha! So many nice things in the home. So many nice things that are now mine. Whoopsie doopsie! I don't know what I picked up. <laughs> in fact, you know what? Because I don't know what I picked up, I'm gonna. Do a little safe scummy. <laughs> there we go. I'm just going to cut that out. Uh, oh, I picked up a skull. That's what I had picked up on accident. Oopsie. Well, um, putting it back would have been a pain. So I guess this is probably the best, uh, <laughs> this is the best course of action. Um, ooh, some garlic. I could use that. Apothecary Satchel. Uh, I guess I could use both of those, but Cure Disease, Potion Recipe, Resist Frost. I know what those are. Death Bells! Death Bells! Yes! That's what I needed. That's what I needed for my poison making. <laughs> <laughs> my future poison making. That's what I needed. That's what I needed to be able to plant. Uh-oh. My phone is doing an alarm that it shouldn't have been doing. Uh, 
Okay, luckily it was also quiet. So, there was that. Uh, this is for the children. When I eventually adopt children. Uh, bookcase. No. Um, well, I might as well eat a little. And then sleep a little. So, let's eat that. Now satisfied. Good. That's good enough. And I shall now eat. Not eat. Sleep. It's one of those things that is required for human life cycles. All right. Beautiful. And there we go. Magic. And then where do I put this point? Where do I put it? I don't know. Hmm. Do I put it into sneak? Maybe I put it into sneak. Yes. Yes, I think it's a good idea. I wake feeling well rested, and I'm probably going to be hungry as fuck. I am peckish now. I was correct in that assumption. Uh, but it's not stupid. There we go. And let's cook. A little bit of food. Just a little bit. Um, I have two leeks. That's fine. It's not ideal. Um, actually, yeah, I'll just use them for the food. And I'll get more leeks from the farm next door. And then I'll plant those. And then I'll have my secondary uh, stash of leeks to be growing. Ooh, I have a baking surface. That's right, I forgot. You get a baking surface in this house as well. Um, lavender. Uh, a lot of these things require butter. And unfortunately, butter is one of those things that it's a little difficult for the game to give you. You have to either buy it off of a merchant or buy one of the hearth fire homes and then they will give you one for some reason. It's a bug. Uh oh. Well, that's fine. It's a bug ongoing that uh, for some reason the butter churns only give you one butter and then never give you any more. It's the weirdest thing. Probably because they never figured out a way to implement a source for the butter to then come from? I don't know. Honestly, I don't know. I would assume that they there's some sort of connection that is missing between having a cow at the home and then the butter churn working properly. Because, I mean, that's essentially where butter comes from. Uh, well, <laughs> the base source is a cow and their milk. But um, I gotta assume it's a broken connection between those two things. But I couldn't tell you for sure. Because I'm not a coder. <laughs> but anyway, enough of me going on and on about stupid shit. Uh, I shall finish my thing. I kind of want to hold on to that. kind of want to hold on to that for reasons. Reasons I cannot understand myself, honestly. Put those away. Uh, uh, yeah, I think that's good. Um, there's a cellar down here where you can show off armor sets galore and all of this cool shit so on this mannequin this one right here we shall honor the white run guards who gave their lives fighting the dragon there you are and when it comes to the axe of white run put that right yeah, I know. Yeah. Beautiful. All right. And then other things I don't need to be wearing. Oh. Oh, that's all right. That's right. This is the one that's equipped, not that one. 
I remember now. Okay. Eventually, I'll sell off or break down some of those things. Um. <laughs> Where's a place I can put more of my crap I don't need? Oh, yeah. The chest outside. That's right. That will work. Yes. Technically, that'll work. Stuff that I will break down eventually when I have the perk to do so. That, that, and all of these. Those I'll be placing up in the house later. I uh, just don't know where I'll do it. Um, hmm, 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 hmm. Okay. And I almost forgot. Place this on. Because I have the hood that will let me do that. <laughs> now my bows will be stronger. <laughs> okay, anyway. That was a beautiful catch. I don't think anyone could ever replicate that again. No one ever. In the history of ever. Of all time. Anyway. Um... Oh, that's right. Barcelona. No, I'm just kidding. I would have to go over here to deal with that. And I should probably mark it off with the quest thing. Uh, right there. Alfield Battleborn. That's what her their name was. Her. It was a her. Okay. Cool. So, someone in the Battleborn clan. That is obvious. I keep hitting wrong buttons. Because I'm an idiot. Um, Weight-wise. I'm doing okay. Weight-wise, I'm doing okay. Although, now that I think about it, before I leave the home, to go on this massive quest of saving the damsel I should probably plant some of my things yes some of my things uh... mm -hmm. put bloom mountain flowers here which I have a lot of holy crap didn't realize I had so many Put wheat here. Cool. Put some blister wart here. Good. And put a leak. Oh. I'll put a leak here when I pluck it. <laughs> when I pluck it. And uh, put bleeding crown here. Yes. And then I will put imp stool here. Yes. And I will put one death bell here and one death bell here. There. And now I shall pull a leak from the wall. Okay, then. That's uh, not what I expected to see like any capacity. Alright. My computer is making a lot of noise. Jesus. Office acting up again? Computer, you can tell me. Alright. Now that I grabbed the leak from the Battleborn farm, I'm saving their kids so they can at least grant me one fucking leak. Alright. Now that I have that, I can... Place the leak here. And call that good. Beautiful. Alright. And now I go to save the Battleborn Kid. Well, I say kid. I don't actually know what her age is. But I'm assuming it's one of the younger ones. Oh! Might not be my computer making that noise. I saw a big ass truck outside. It might be... Uh, trash truck day. Now I think about it, that's probably exactly what it is. Alright. Now I am all kitted out. Not as upgraded as I would hope, but upgraded enough. 
And eventually, I shall get to Broken Fang Cave and save the damsel. It will just take a long while because I have no fast travel. So this trek will take a bit of time. So I'll leave it up to you guys. Uh, I'll leave it up to you kids. Do you want to watch the trek to the particular quest? Or do you want to just let me fast forward to it and unless something important happens, then I will do uh, the action in question for whatever important thing happens depends really on uh, what's going on but uh, I'll leave it up to you guys to talk in the comments because this is currently the end of the episode I'm just going to walk my way there and uh, try to get some of the trek done <laughs> because why not right anyway thank you all so much for watching click the subscribe button if you like these videos and you want to see more click the like button if you like this particular video and share in comments so we can bring more people into this community we can talk about the games we're playing together and i will see y'all in the next episode this has been the one the only stray cat playing games and trying to catch a stand butterfly god damn it there we go and uh heading off on a noble quest to save a damsel in distress from the battleborn clan and uh you know in general just try and do the right thing and help people for money because i mean why else would you help people right i mean you know side out of the goodness of your heart but uh either way i will do the thing but uh, i'll also do some hunting along the way because i am how i am uh but uh anyway we'll get there eventually for you